Yes. Well, it was a good win because we'd lost, lost three in a row. And our team, this team, has really been struggling. We've played good. I mean, we, we've played everybody to the wire. Every game's been down to the wire. But we finally pulled one out. It was big time for us. It was definitely a, a, a big step for us in the right direction. Um, you know, like I said before, a couple times we, we got down to that last drive and we, we weren't able to finish and we ended up losing a couple games. Um, and for us to come back from behind like that just, just proves how much character and heart we have on this team. And uh, have a lot of fight. And, and it was a good start to the second half of the season and um, should keep us going for the rest of the season. The first half, I, I believe, is the poorest I can ever remember one of my teams playing. It was the poorest first half. I mean, we had nine dadgum penalties. Then we came back out and got two more. You know what? But dadgum, the fact is you wouldn't quit and you wouldn't give up and you kept hustling and you started making plays, you showed what you're made of. And that's, that's, that, that's the greatest thing there is. That's, that overcomes all that other stuff. You know what? You know something? I ripped, I push, we pride as coaches, all of us. We kick you, we fight you we, to make you the best because we do love you because we know what you're capable of when you come out there and do that. Is there a feeling better in this world than doing what you're doing out there right now when you fight and claw and scratch like that? I told you, it's the ones you remember. But you gotta remember, it ain't gonna be easy, it never is. And we always gotta push. And I, I challenged you at halftime. And I challenged you and I said whatever I had to say because I meant it, because it's the truth, it's the way we were. But I also know what's in you and who you are when we walk back out there and do what we did in the second half. Don't make me push anymore. I'll push, but don't make me come down there and get that anymore. Because I'm going to tell you something. There's something in this group that's special, guys. I'm telling you. You're special. We can take over everything. and can, You can score when you want. You can do whatever you want. It's just a mindset. And there's character in here. There's heart. There's toughness. There's great kids. And it's, it's in you. You just got to let it out. And I'll, and I'll say this. As much as I've been on you, I ain't never been as proud of a group of kids I coached in 21 years of what you got in the second half with what's happened to us all year where we're at, where we were at that time, and could have packed this program in. Those are things that change, change futures, your futures, who you are and what you are and what you, shows you what you're capable of, and that's what you got to fight through. You can't forget that. And remember, you did it together. It took every one of us and every role and everything you did. And it's going to do it again, and we got to do it in practice, and it's got to continue on the next week because we got to change, and we're going to set a foundation for this place that can never be broken. It can never fall. And we're going to end this season the right way and have one hell of a year. You hear me? We're going to have one hell of a year. If we got to score every drive, we get the football. It don't make a darn. That's what we're going to do. I'm proud as hell of you guys. Get a break. Oh, break it cold, break it cold. Uh, nine yards or something. Hey, love on three. One, two, three. Love! How that feel? How that feel?